put it into this Model N Briggs and Stratton, which has an identical flywheel and magneto. This magneto is dead, but this engine has good bearings. And uh, I just got to switch out a couple of the head bolts here that are too long for that one. Um, I'll put an air stack on this thing off of one of the Model 8 engines. It uses the same flow jet carburetor. And uh, I'll get this engine running, hopefully today. And then I'm going to try and get my little 6 volt generator there to run. I have my old tractor battery here and I'll see if I can get it to spark. I got to clean out the fuel tank still. Luckily it's got a little tiny Carter suction carburetor here. Got the flywheel in between. Yeah, flywheel's down there. You can kind of see it moving. It's a pretty cool old generator. Here's the WI with its flywheel off. You can see the magneto is exposed. I removed the cover. Here's the flywheel. There's the Model N. Basically the same engine block. Same exact magneto. Just different carburetor. Different gas tank. It's got a gravity fed fuel system on that where this has a little suction system. This actually has a different carburetor than my running WI. This is a newer one. See, there's more fins on the head than my other running WI from 1941. And I'll give you an update in a few minutes. It's alive! And it has almost no compression, but it's running. Well, it was. Huh. At least I saw it run. A little bit. I have the gas shut off on top of the tank, so it's just running a little bit. Turns out it's got leaky gaskets, bad rings. Uh, I didn't even mess with the carburetor, I just took a spare carburetor I had that I did use in my rototiller for a short time. But this carburetor leaks like a sieve. Um, bolt valve doesn't work right. But This is the first time I've ever actually had my 1941 Briggs & Stratton WI apart since it's a good running engine. But I wanted to make sure my oil pump was in good shape. And, I don't know if you can see that or not. But it, it still pumps oil, so the oil pump must be in good shape. I'm just going to clean all the sludge out and make sure we're in good shape. But uh, this engine, I just replaced the spark wire on it because it was getting kind of ratty looking. But it, it's still a good running engine. Starts right up. And um, I'll have it back together again in no time.